Welcome. My name is Amelia Perry, and I'm a center manager for UTP High Schools. We are so excited to welcome you to our UTP High Schools community. You've been accepted to one of our elite private high schools, and that is such an academic and amazing accomplishment. You've already proven your academic excellence, your eagerness to explore a new culture, as well as your growing mastery of the English language. You will be attending one of our eight partner high schools across the United States. We have two in New Hampshire, Bishop Girton High School and St. Thomas Aquinas, two in New York, St. John the Baptist and St. Anthony's, two in Florida, Melbourne Central Catholic and Trinity Catholic, one in Arizona, Seton Catholic, and one in California, Fairmont. UTP partners with elite private high schools across the United States so that you can get an excellent American education that is going to set you up for success in the future. We handle everything from start to finish. So as soon as you are accepted, you have full support to make sure that you are not only achieving academic excellence, but you are adapting to a new culture, thriving socially, and making memories. We handle everything from from peer tutor matching to your host family experience to giving you ESL support and much, much more. And that's all because we want to set you up for success once you leave high school and go on to university. In fact, that's what our name stands for, University Track Preparation. So UTP handles a myriad of things. And the best reason why we can do so efficiently and effectively is because of our on-campus model. We have an office on site at every school. And this allows you to come see us for help immediately. There will be no delay in us solving your problems. In every office, we have a center manager, a student services team, and ESL teachers. We are all here and ready to help you every day. The office is open before and after school, and you can come just to hang out, or if you have questions, or if you just want to hang out with your friends and relax in between classes. There are many things that we will be helping you with. From when you arrive at the airport, we make sure that you arrive safely and you're welcomed by providing you your I-20. This allows you to enter America, as well as when you go home to visit family and friends. And once you're in school, we provide your schedule and arrange your classes. If you're struggling, we'll also find you a tutor to help you with the material that you may need. Beyond your classes, we want to make sure that you're having fun too. So we provide lots of opportunities for you to join clubs and sports and make American friends and memories. We also manage the host family experience so that you are getting the full American experience and understanding the culture from that aspect. We want your parents to know how well you're doing, so we'll send report cards and progress reports and formal reports home to share your academic successes as well as your social ones too. And anything that you may need, you can come to us for help. So, you've already been accepted and you're preparing to come overseas and start this experience abroad. So when you're packing, be sure to remember to bring your I-20, your passport, and a copy of your host family's information with you on your carry-on. Don't check it away in your stored luggage. And on your first day of school, please bring those documents as well, in addition to any medical official documents you may have or school transcripts. So when you are packing your luggage, it is important to bring a few things to feel prepared and ready to start the school year. So depending on what school you're going to, you'll want to bring clothes and attire that's appropriate for the seasons. So if you're headed north, be sure to bring some winter clothes and warm layers. And if you're headed more south, don't forget a bathing suit and sunscreen too. You'll also need to have leather or suede shoes and black socks for your uniforms. And for your school materials, feel free to bring any stationery or pens and pencils and folders that you like to have from home. You'll also need a backpack to carry all your belongings with you. And you will want to bring either a computer, laptop, or tablet so that you can be able to do some work and study from home, as well as talk to your friends and families. Be sure to bring either a dictionary or an electronic translator, as you will not be able to use a translator on tests and quizzes, but you may want to have them for academic support in your classes and when you're studying too. And if you have any medications or prescriptions, please bring that with the English translations so that we can help you make sure you're taking that safely and that the school knows. And don't forget about the fun things too. So bring your camera, your headphones, your music so that you can document all the fun things that you've been doing while you're living abroad in the United States. So when you arrive to the USA, you will see us there welcoming you. Either your host family or UTP will be there and we'll have our nice blue shirts on and big signs waving hello and welcoming you. So when you come into the airport, be sure to go all the way into the arrivals terminal. You'll have to check your luggage and show your I-20. And that's why you want to make sure that you bring it on your carry-on. We'll be waiting inside the terminal for you. So when you arrive, you don't need to call us as we'll have your flight information. So we'll be checking when you land. And please be sure not to leave the airport terminal without us. 
And I'd like to show you what that experience is like when you land on U.S. soil and you see the UTP team. So all of your center managers and student services team members will be at the airport waiting for you. If you still cannot find us once you've gone through security and collect your luggage, please give us a call. So for parents, we know this is a really exciting and also a bit nervous time to send your child overseas. We really do want to show you the environment that they'll be exploring, but the beginning of the school year is a very busy time for us as we want to make sure that our students are acclimating and really starting to build the foundation of relationships. Please know that transportation services from the airport and to the school or the host family are just for students, and we'd be happy to schedule a tour for you of the school a few months after the school year begins. So, you're now ready to meet your host family. You spend 50% of your time at school and 50% of your time at home, so it's really important that your host family experience allows you to experience the culture and you're building the relationships. All of our hosts go through an extensive application process, and we want to make sure that they are safe and ready to host you and show you what the American lifestyle is all about. We place you with our host families based on your personality and your interests. We want to make sure that you already have things in common and that you'll be able to learn from each other. They are so eager to welcome a new son or daughter into their family, and we'll help you learn how to build the relationship so you're not alone in that either. Your host families, they'll have a room with you with a desk, a bed, and a dresser, so you have proper study space to make sure that you are doing well with your academics. They'll also be living very close to the school, between five and 25 minutes away. So you'll be in the neighborhood and get to know where your friends are living as well. They are very excited to meet you. And so here is a look at what the host family experience is all about. My name is Emily Brosnan. My role with the company is the host family manager. We really just hope that the students have that home away from home here, and we know that our host families will exceed our expectations with that. I'm Debbie Borelli, and I've been a host family for two years. And I have the same girls. They came back to me for the two years. We have dinner every night together. I treat them the way I treat my daughter. We have the same rules and we talk about everything. I feel that the communication has to be open. I enjoy every minute of it. So living in the United States is going to be extremely different. You may have traveled here before, but really living here for a long period of time, you're going to learn so many new things. And I want you to know that you're not alone in adapting to this. You may be nervous at first, or it may be really scary, but we're here to help you through that. So things such as the food, the customs, the lifestyles, the daily schedules and conversations, those may be all new experiences for you. But we'll teach you, as well as your host family, about all the new customs and traditions that you're going to experience while living in the United States. So when you need help, don't be afraid to ask. That's what we're here for. We won't know if you need help unless you ask, so please don't be ashamed. It is a very normal thing to ask questions in class, ask your host family how something works, or ask UTP how you can make the experience better or what you can be involved in. We're here for you every day in the UTP office, and your host family is here for you too. We are your friends, your mentors, and your counselors. We want to make sure that your experience is effortless and memorable. We'll be giving you the contact information for your center managers and student services team members. So you can reach out to us. If you aren't able to come to the office, you can send us a text or give us a call too. So a big part of living in America is experiencing American culture. And that's what the American Experience events are. So it's already part of your tuition and you'll be given a certain number of points that can be used towards fun events in the area. Everything from skiing to surfing on the beach, 
events big and small, but they're such great ways to not only make new friends and have new experiences, but also practice your English too and learn about what's special of the place you're living in. And here is a great look at what an American Experience event is really like. UTP's American Experience program is such a valid asset of our all-encompassing servicing that we provide for our international students. It is a great way for students to explore where they're living. Our schools are attractive because of their location and the, the great things that are in the surrounding communities. And so a brand new student arrives in New York or Arizona, New Hampshire or Florida, and they might not know what's fun to go visit, what's fun to go see. The American Experience program kind of takes that planning out of their worry zone. So our team manages, coordinates, chaperones, and designs events in the local area to make sure our students are seeing the best of their local community or the, the famous sites in the area. And this is a great way for students to be teenagers and to have fun with each other and build those bonds and memories that they'll bring home with them. Students leave UTP with the best experience because they are part of the school community. They are not just passing through the hallways, they're part of a place, they're part of a community and a family that's going to be everlasting. So when you arrive at school, we'll be having a multi-day orientation that's going to tell you everything you need to know to start the school year off right. So we'll provide your schedule, your books, and your locker. We'll give you many school tours as well, but even more so is about building the relationships and foundation at the school. So we'll have lots of fun events and opportunities for you to make friends with the other international students as well as the domestic students in your school. It is going to be a great time to see what you can get involved in and to ask the questions that may be still lingering or the questions you may still have. We've been welcoming students since 2011, so we've really gotten great insight of what makes a successful year or many years at UTP High School's partner schools. A successful student comes to school every day Domestic students only miss three to four school days in a whole year. So it's really important to come to class every day so that you are showing your teachers that you care to be in their classrooms and so that you're getting the academic instruction that you need. It's also really important to be in full uniform. You wanna dress your best so that you can achieve academic excellence. And be sure to do all of your homework and do your best on quizzes and tests. For the work that you do, please make sure that it is your own. Copying and pasting from the internet or from a friend is not allowed in American schools. If you have any questions about how to cite your work properly, we'll be happy to help you. And lastly, overall, please be respectful and polite to your fellow peers as well as your teachers, faculty, and staff. We want to make sure that everyone is enjoying their experience and we're all in it together. There are a few UTP policies to keep you safe during your time here. You may be already planning a trip home, so our travel policy requires that you give us 30-day notice of your plans prior to booking your flight. We'll need to receive consent from your parents overseas and notify your host family as well before you book your flights. And once you do, as long as you're not missing school, you can go visit family and friends with a trusted guardian. There are also other policies and rules that you must abide by that are the same as the schools. So the schools do not tolerate bullying, using drugs or alcohol, and cheating as well. These are just a few of the things that we'll discuss during orientation, and we'll also be giving you the school handbook too. So, coming to the United States, as I said, is a new experience. Many of you are here to go to a terrific university after you graduate, or to experience American culture, as well as improve your English. And you are going to be surrounded by native English speakers, and the more you use your English, the better your skills will become. So please try hard in your ESL class so that you are gaining the academic English skills you need as well as the social English skills. Make friends with students that are not from your country and spend lots of time with your host family. Those conversations at dinner and outside in the backyard are how you're going to improve your social English skills. Make sure you read books in English, listen to music and watch movies too, as that's all going to help you improve your mastery. Also, ask questions if you don't understand. It's okay to stop someone and ask them to speak slower or repeat it again. So, what does a successful student look like? A successful student is one that tries their best and gives 100% effort. They're involved in school activities, sports, clubs, and attending the school play. They spend time with their host family and they make friends with students that are not from their country. 
They try their best at school, do all their work, come to school prepared and on time, and they respect their teachers, classmates, and host families as well. Doing all of that will make sure that you do have that memorable experience that we want to provide you. We are so excited to welcome you to the UTP High Schools family. We'll see you soon.